All right, guys. I figured since I have over 90 hours on the Hustler now, I thought I'd do a review. So this is a review of the Hustler Raptor SD 42-inch zero-turn mower. It is a residential mower, and as you can see, the back tires are not as beefy as I would like them to be. That's one of the, the negatives on this mower. But sorry about the sunlight, guys. Um, but it's still an awesome mower. The seat is wonderful. It's like riding on air. Um, so let's go over some of the positives of the Raptor SD. The first thing is, it's got a heavier steel deck. Um, I think it's got a 10 gauge steel deck. Um, it's very solid, very nice, very heavy, durable. Um, I like the big caster wheels on the front. Those are a huge plus. Um, the deck uh, lowering and raising is very simple. You just take out this pin here and you set it to whatever you want. Um, one drawback to this, and this is a negative, I guess I'll come back to that. Um, I like the, the foot operation for the, the deck raising. Um, I think that's awesome. Um, very smooth hydros, guys. Very smooth. Uh, does not com compared to my old Husqvarna, which is now sold. Um, there's no comparison. When I drove it to get it on the tr guy's trailer, uh, who I sold it to, that thing was jerking all over the place. These are very smooth. Very nice. Very nice hydros on this machine. Um, it's got the Kohler Pro Performance Package motor. It's 22 horsepower, 7000 series. It's got a three year uh, limited consumer warranty. Uh, it's a very good engine. No problems so far with uh, 90 hours on it. Comes with a hitch as do all Hustler mowers. Um, all right, let's go through some cons. Well, yeah, let's go through some cons. The first con that that I have, and it's a pretty important one, is the opening on the deck. The deck opening is not nearly as big as I would want it to be. Um, it. I've plugged that thing full of grass before. So that is a huge negative to the to the SD series and the, the Raptor series itself. They're both the same opening. Um, so that's a huge negative and that's about the only negative other than the rear tires which they had to make smaller for the 42 inch deck. Um, so I'm not going to lie, that doesn't bother me too much. Um, but they they do tend to uh, rip up a lawn a little bit easier. So uh, you really got to be careful and take turns slow and things like that. Um, another positive with the SD series is the blade tip speed. Uh, the blade tip speed on the SD is right around... 18,400 uh, per minute so that is awesome blade tip speed for a residential mower the cut on this thing is phenomenal um, I love it um, it cuts very well it does not stripe good though um, I had a lawn today that I did that I actually got some stripes out of it after I went over it a second time um, so, got some stripes. You know, it has a smaller gas tank, which is a drawback. Um, 
and uh, yeah other than that I mean it's a great mower it's got power um, it's f pretty fast um, and it's it's just great I mean it works awesome um, would I recommend it to a commercial operator a small company yes yes I would um, if you've got a lot of small gates to get through in backyards absolutely um, but I would recommend the Raptor SD 52 inch over the 42 inch um, if you know if you're looking to do large amounts of grass um, that would be my recommendation uh, because while I love the 42 inch because I can get into some gated backyards I really should have gone with a larger deck um, and the salesman when I bought it advised me that I should but I I was stuck on the 42 inch and so that's what I went with and I'm kind of regretting that now but another drawback to this unit is there's only one anti-scalp wheel terrible design hustler terrible design it needs at least another anti-scalp wheel on the other side and probably one on the other side in the front um, you can easily scalp a yard with this thing when you're turning so um, unless it's completely flat ground so terrible design hustler on on the 42 inch deck if I had anything to add to the deck on this one it would be at least two more anti scalp wheels and I understand space is limited but there is places to put it in so um, that is the only other thing that I would change about this is the anti scalp wheels other than that, it is a great mower, um, an excellent mower, very smooth, comfortable ride. Um, as you can see, I've got 91 hours on this sucker, so very used very much. I use it every day, and it's awesome. So, if you guys have any questions about it, any comments, Please let me know down below and we can uh, take it from there. So yeah, I love the, the Raptor SD and I would buy another one today if I had the money. So um, I am considering a Toro Stander. It's, it's out of my price range. I would definitely have to finance it, um, which is not something I want to do right now, and especially because it's been so dry. I'm just kind of holding my breath right now and waiting to see what happens. Uh, but if I go with a stander, I'm definitely going to go with like a 52 or a 60 um, because I do have a lot of bigger yards and a lot of yards that I can use a bigger mower on that aren't big. So. Um, I'm just uh, waiting and and uh, trying to be patient and trying to make the right decision for Lansing Lawn Service. Alright guys, like, comment, subscribe, share my videos if you like them, if they're helpful, and uh, please comment. I love comments, uh, whether it's nice video or anything just give me a couple of comments guys I need your interaction I'm lonely I need your love I need your affirmation no seriously God, just just leave some comments okay alright bye